Hey, it's Dee Rano with Potsfollow.com and basically gonna do another little vlog and I'm right now at home on my kitchen making some food for the family for breakfast even though it is 10.30 10.30 but yeah, uh, gonna go over some uh, something that I like to do every time I cook something uh, and here it is, this is basically it basically some food photography with my Minolta SRT 101 in this case I have a 50mm f1.7 one of my favorite cameras because not only is all manual it's vintage looking it still works and it's really 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 sharp and the images come out really really nice and right now I will be photographing as soon as I can flip this over no I should have cut that on video <laughs> but yeah this is basically what I'm doing this is my interpretation on scrambled eggs or oh, on huevos rancheros due to the fact that it has the egg some onions or oh, I'm shooting all the way over here some eggs, some onions, uh, some, uh, I don't know what the name of them are, if, if you could find out, post it at the bottom, uh, as a comment, some of the, oh, some green onions, that oh, is right there, I actually have some little cherry tomatoes for large eggs, I also have, um, smoked sausage here, And yeah, that's basically my little interpretation on huevo rancheros due to the fact that huevo rancheros have tomatoes, onions, oh, and jalapenos on them, but in this case, I didn't use jalapenos, I used some chili sauce for my eggs. And yeah, basically, okay. So I will be shooting this with my Minolta. I'm um, kind of close again. It's hard to do it with one hand. Due to the fact that I have to focus, uh, where can I put it? Move the oil there. There, hopefully, see. the little exposure at the bottom thing on uh, put it as one two seven one of the things I like about it Okay. Basically, I uh, just took. I just took a couple shots. Oh, I am a little bit with the allergies today, but it's okay. Uh, yeah, the food's almost. The food is done. Good way to tell if it's done or not. If you don't see anything sticking to the pan means it's done oh that's how I could tell it's done you might have another way uh, that's my way and yeah okay uh, I will be posting these images once I get them developed in like a week or so at potsphoto.com also on flickr.com slash potsphoto uh, the reason it takes a week is because I'm still not done with the roll. 
I don't use this one as much as I used to due to the fact that where I get it developed it's not as it's kind of pricey so I have to go through two rolls to get a discount or a decent discount and yeah that is pretty much it for today uh, I will probably be doing more vlogging daily vlogging if anything I'll give out a couple of prices on whoever follows most of the vlogs uh, like like what uh, uh, a friend of mine Dennis is doing uh, basically vlogging for a year shout out to him at uh, what is it uh, flash me silly the, the channel for them probably post a link to them baby crying okay so that's a sign for me to quit so I can feed the people uh, Deodorano with potsphoto.com again you can find my images at potsphoto.com facebook.com slash potsphoto twitter.com slash potsphoto flickr.com slash potsphoto potsphoto.tumblr.com and almost anywhere with potsphoto